Hey everyone, welcome back to Shade Review. In today's video, we are reviewing the Porsche Design P8508 sunglasses. So first, let's go ahead and pop these on face and talk a little bit about the company. Porsche Design is a German product design studio that was originally founded back in 1972 by F.A. Porsche, the designer of the original Porsche 911. And the Porsche Design brand is known for their very high high-end accessories, including sunglasses, pens, and even watches. So with that being said, we're going to go ahead and talk about the quality of these sunglasses and if they are worth the relatively expensive price tag. Now this pair of sunglasses has 60 millimeter lenses and a 12 millimeter bridge. Now to put that in perspective, the original Ray-Ban Aviator sunglasses has 58 millimeter lenses and a 14 millimeter bridge. So here is a pair of the classic standard size of the original Ray-Ban Aviator and I'll give you guys a quick little 180 of how these sunglasses look on face. And now let me go ahead and pop on these Porsche design frames and see how they look in comparison to those Ray-Ban aviators. So in my opinion, these sunglasses definitely look very good. They're not really trying to copy Ray-Ban too much. They definitely have their own uh, designed personalities here on the bridge. And even the lens shape is gonna be a little bit different than the Ray-Ban aviator sunglasses. So it's really nice to see that they actually did do a little bit of work to design these a little bit different than just your classic standard Ray-Ban and aviator sunglasses. Now Porsche says the metal frames here are made out of a very lightweight stainless steel material and that's also going to be corrosion resistant which is really nice to see as well. These sunglasses do have very premium and nice three barrel all metal hinges and they feel very very premium when opening them up and when closing them they just feel very nice and substantial definitely very high end. They also have fully adjustable nose rests and they have this little rubberized material here which really sits on the nose very well and that rubberized material here also helps the frame frames stick on your face and not slide down the nose, which is also really nice. Now these sunglass frames have Porsche design painted here on the top left corner of the lens, which looks really nice. And they also say Porsche design here on the outside left temple of the frames as well to let people know that of course you're wearing a pair of Porsche sunglasses. So that's kind of cool for people who are into that. Now these frames are made in Italy. They say here in the inner right ear rest of the sunglasses, they just say made in Italy, which is also nice. And then also here in the inner right temple of the frames, we can see they also say Porsche design, which is pretty cool. Now in the lower bridge of the frames, they actually have some more etched information. And this particular pair says 54500. And I'm actually not sure what that information means. That's not the dimensions of these frames. Frames. So I'm not sure if that's like that on every single pair, but I figured I would mention that it does have that engraved on there anyways, because of course this is an authentic pair of sunglasses, and I'm assuming that every pair of authentic sunglasses has some type of etching there. I'm, I'm just not sure what those numbers exactly mean. Now probably the biggest downside of these sunglasses for me is the fact that the lenses are made out of a polymer or plastic material, so they're not going to be made out of all glass lenses, and because of that the lenses are going to actually easily scratch, so if you drop them on the floor or on concrete, they're gonna scratch up very easily. Where in contrast, a pair of Ray-Ban aviators, because they have all glass lenses, are not going to scratch nearly as easily as these, so that's definitely a downside, but they do have a very nice anti reflective material, which is gonna block 100% of UVA and UVB rays, which is very important. And the optical clarity of these is very good. They're just not gonna have quite as good optical clarity as a pair of sunglasses with all glass lenses. But because these sunglasses have polymer lenses, they're gonna be much more lightweight than a pair of Ray-Ban aviators. As far as build quality goes, these are built really nice, and one way you can tell is the quality of the welds. They're just absolutely perfect here and look really, really nice. They're not sloppy or anything like that whatsoever. And all the materials here feel very premium and nice. And there are absolutely no imperfections on this pair of sunglasses that I can see, which is really nice to see as well. Now, as far as coverage from the sun goes, because these have an aviator style to them, they offer very good coverage from the sun. So here up top, we can see there is not really a gap to let sunlight in unprotected. And then here on the sides, again, there is not really a big gap at all to let sunlight in unprotected, which makes this pair of sunglasses very, very practical, which is really nice to see. Now, as far as pricing goes, the sunglass frames are going to be a little bit expensive coming in at $380 directly from 
Porsche Designs website and in most stores. However, I found these much cheaper on Amazon for around the $200 price range. So I'm going to leave a link down below directly to these sunglasses where you guys can check them out on Amazon and hopefully save a couple hundred dollars by doing so. And I think for that around $200 price range, these sunglass frames are definitely worth the money, especially if you're a Porsche enthusiast and you potentially even own a Porsche, it's really cool to have a matching pair of sunglasses to your car as well. And I'm really impressed with Porsche here because they didn't cheap out with the design or the build quality of these frames by just slapping their name on this pair of sunglasses. You can tell this pair of sunglasses was definitely very thought through and the execution here came out very good as well. So I really enjoyed wearing this pair of sunglasses. Let me know if you guys want to see more reviews over Porsche design sunglasses in the future. I do know they make some even more expensive, very high-end titanium frame sunglasses, which would be definitely interesting to make a review view over. So if you guys are interested in that video, make sure to drop me a comment letting me know if you want to see more videos on Porsche design sunglasses. Well, that's all I got for you guys in this video. If you guys enjoyed it, make sure to give me a big thumbs up below. And of course, make sure to hit that subscribe button and then you'll be notified every single time I upload a brand new video just like this one to my YouTube channel. Again, thank you all so much for watching and I'll catch you all in the next one.